Okay, welcome back folks. Um, as you can see, I'm not at all prepared to do this recording. I actually completely forgot that uh, I was supposed to record, so give me one second here. Okay, great. So, basically today, um, I recorded something, uh, as I said before, I recorded, I've been recording a different series for a bit, and yeah, basically that means that I haven't had, put a lot of thought into, like, doing this series, and it really doesn't help that I had to do it, I, or well, I didn't have to, but I did the, um, the video from yesterday, the, uh, Trunk Updates video, like, I don't know, and for some reason, like, my index finger, which is my, like, O button, no, like my B and N, it's really hurting for some reason. I think I may have hit something on it because it really hurts. So like pressing buttons has been kind of painful and given that it's like the button I use for all movement it really sucks. So you'll have to forgive me if I play a little bit slower today. Though from what I'm aware of most people will enjoy that. Like ow. Every time I hit something with my index finger it just sucks to me so feels good now. Um, Bit of an update I guess considering this series isn't too stressful yet. Uh oh, Sentinel Moth. That's pretty bad. Okay, this is really bad. Um how many cancellations do we have? We have one. It's probably not worth it to do this. I can probably just fight my way through this, I think. But I won't uh won't be hesitant to use any of my big abilities. Okay, yeah, this is definitely a corruption. So I'm using this to do two, to achieve, bleh, to achieve two real goals. One, to make some distance while I'm marked. And two, to let me escape with the teleport. I mean, I am still marked while I'm teleporting, but it's not too big of a deal. Okay, so, looks like I get another stat up. I think that dex is a decent change, uh, decent, decent raise. I mean, like, strength isn't bad by any means, but, oh my god. Alright, I'm actually going to put the evasion, I'm going to take off the evasion for, oh, for MR. This is getting a bit ridiculous here. Like, this is actually stupid. Like, I've been marked twice already, it's only vaults one, and I can't corrupt again, so this is like, double pain. Like, ah, oh god. I really wish I could do something here, but nope. I'm just going to fight until like my mark is almost done, and then I'll teleport again. That's probably the best way to do it. And right back into the fire. Not that that's anything out of the ordinary for us, mind you, but, you know, still. Might as well commentate on it while I can. While I'm still alive. Alright, well, we managed to take out most of those enemies. And with the MR now, the blue guy won't be as strong. The uh, Sentinel. Looks like our mutations weren't amazing this time around. Or maybe they just nerfed it. I don't know. I don't know if they've kept robust in the game, but, you know, if they haven't, that sucks, but if they have, I'm pretty sad I didn't get it. Robust is, like, probably my favorite mutation. Plus 30% HP is no joke, man. Alright, another big vault of dudes. That's fine. This weapon is very strong at just taking out enemies, which is good. I'm just going to check for another evening star, because if there is another one, we can actually brand weapon it and all that crap. I think I have a brand weapon. No, I don't actually. Okay. That's fine. Oh, right. We can brand weapon it with the, uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, without the Gonu ability. I totally slipped my mind for some reason. I don't know. Like, look, I've been playing a lot of Stardew Valley. I'm, I'm just, I don't even remember how to play this game. I'm just kind of playing by ear. Uh, let's get all these items. They're pretty good. Uh, protection, no fire, regeneration. Protection from fire is decent, but we already have one, so it's not that necessary. There's a lot of great maces on the floor, which is one of the powers of mace. You do get a lot of great, ma uh, great maces, but I have an evening star and a shield, so there's no real point in considering it yet. Unless I found something that was actually artifact, I probably wouldn't bother even looking at them. Just because I know, like, an evening star is still a really good weapon. Alright, so it looks like our antennae mean that means that we can't actually wear hats. That's fine. Vile of Floods, hmm. 
That does make me wonder if evocations is the right way to go. Nah, we'll leave it for now. Okay, we're standing in our own miasma, which is... There's no point in that. We don't take damage from it, but... I need something else to get hit by it, not just me. Alright. Actually, we might as well recharge this Rod of Clouds. We don't really know what it does, but whatever. Um... It's a lot of food. I guess we'll eat a royal jelly. Mostly just because there's a lot of stuff in inventory and I kind of am annoyed by it. Ow. Was that a crystal spear? Yes, it was. Okay. I'm abyssing this. Oh, no. I'll just melee him. I was going to abyss that ogre mage, but it's fine. Uh, here, you could say that I was like cornering myself, but because I have distortion blink, it's fine. Like, it's okay to actually like put yourself in those kind of situations as long as you know what you're doing. In that case, it's a bunch of ogres, and I'm not going to die to them. Alright, this is kind of scary. Okay, just casually take off our health. Okay, might actually have to blink here, just to escape this guy. I don't think he does 50 damage in one shot, but we're going to move backwards anyway, just because I feel like there's going to be enemy yeah, enemies right around the corner. That's fine, though. Managed to handle it. I don't know, playing Crawl does not feel real right now. Like, maybe I'm just really tired. I had like four hours of sleep because I had to get up. I completely forgot that I'd work uh, in the morning and then my alarm kindly woke me up. See, I'm one of those people that like will set an alarm and then completely forget about it until like it actually goes off. So, yeah, I got wrecked. Alright, let's go ahead and abyss the red. The red does decent damage. We'll go ahead and abyss the blue as well, just to make this fight slightly less ridiculous. Let's use a lightning rod here, just to kind of make a bit of AoE. It's not a big deal, but whatever. Uh, note that the green can actually die from absorbing um, ally damage. Didn't know that. Pretty cool to know, I guess. Quite happy that uh, Ogre Mage is no longer abyss you. It's pretty helpful. I mean, not with this character, obviously, because I can just leave, but, you know, it's nice to be able to kind of shoehorn that back into, like, a medium threat with sometimes ridiculous threat if it crystal spears you twice in a row. Like, it's one of those enemies. Just random burst damage for no reason. Just because. Alright. Got surrounded by slimes. Not a good spot to be in, but that's not horrible. I mean, we're playing quite poorly, you can you can really tell, but like I said, my finger hurts. I just, <laughs> I don't know guys, it really hurts. Like, distractingly painful. Ah. I actually don't know what that is, that really sucks. Ow. Like, I didn't even notice it until I started playing. Um, I mean, it's obviously not something that like happened just then. Not like me pressing the keyboard is going to make my finger hurt, but hey, whatever. Quality content. Pretty good, I guess. This guy is like progressing pretty easily towards his goal of winning the game. I mean, really, like, there's not much to say about a melee character. It's been done. We know how to play melee. It's just that this character just so happens to be a slightly more uh, invocations based character, which makes him ever so slightly more interesting. Um, I do really like Abyss Knight. I used to hate it. Uh, around my first greater player in my Kind of my second one too. I was really against Greater Player, uh, against Abyss Knight. I was like, oh god, I have to play Abyss Knight. Just put it off. But around like my third ish time playing Abyss Knight, like for the win, I mean, and about like, I'd say roughly around my third Greater Player almost. Oh god. Not quite though, like about halfway, uh, through my Greater Player, my third Greater Player, I actually did start playing a couple of Abyssal Knights for, um, oh, we just backed ourselves into a corner here. Actually, gonna teleport. There's too many, too many things there. And yeah, just as my intuition proved, there were a bunch of enemies that were quite dangerous over there. Okay, getting shit on a little bit here. It's all right. Just abuse the corner. So, because oh man, we're taking some heavy damage here. Let's go ahead and use Rod of Clouds. It doesn't do much, but since it's so big AOE, oh actually, there it did pretty good stuff. But uh, ordinarily, I guess. Well, it's not uh, weak by any stretch of the imagination. That's not what I'm calling it. Because the Rod of Clouds is never weak. Um, it's Therefore, it makes no sense for the Wand of Clouds to be weak. But 
essentially like you just want to hit a whole bunch of stuff with it. It's really good when you can hit like the whole screen. But like I said, it's not good enough to actually use as a main weapon anymore. Not that it really was, but you know, still. The option's gone now. Pretty much forever. Unless Vakelis comes back, but eh. I don't know. I didn't really like Vakelis. We are getting really badly swarmed this this vault. It's kinda weird. Like that's a lot more enemies than you'd expect. Maybe I'm just haven't maybe just haven't been in a vault in a while. And it's being surprised how much there is. But no, seriously, that's a lot of enemies at once. Like, we've been swamped by those big-ass groups for, like, maybe four or five times already. It's only bolts two. I'm going to pull back here just into this corridor area where they can't all hit me at once. Into the corner I go. Probably not necessary there, but I don't know. Just habits. Okay, so that guy can abyss me. I can abyss him. I'm not going to bother because I can just kill him. And if he abysses me, I'll just leave anyway. Honestly, like, Enter the Abyss is pretty much a free win for an Abyssal Knight. It's instant heal, essentially. Uh, though it costs a lot of piety. So being abyssed here actually is quite cheap. Did we really drop our Lightning Rod? No, we just picked another one up. We didn't pick it up, but we just saw another one. For some reason I thought I dropped it, but I don't know. I've been playing pretty slow, so I don't see how that happens. Ow, my finger. I just hope that I don't have to move diagonally. That's like the main time when I have to use the index window. Ah, there's a the diagonal movement. <laughs> Hurts so bad. <laughs> Why? Well, look at this. This character's just absolutely face rolling everything. Don't really know how, but yeah, he's doing it. Whatever. Just accept. Move on. God, these pink. These salmon elves. I don't know how else to explain them. Their robes look like salmon, but they're just like, they say like deep elf mage, but like, it just is like everything. It's like conjurations and summoning. Like all of the mages put together. I mean, before there wasn't a deep elf summoner, right? Probably. I'm um, just gonna wait for this guy to come towards me. Ettons are not to be messed with. I've actually been 1v1 by an Etten before, on a troll too. It's pretty crazy. He hit 60 like three ro three rounds in a row, and I was like, oh, okay. This was, of course, uh, back when my auto fight was at a measly 50%, I think it was. Yeah, so I probably would have died in like, I probably died one turn after I realized I was like dead as hell. That was pretty interesting. But ever since then, I've just like not wanted to mess with Edens at all. I don't know. Random anecdote of the day, I guess. And apparently Mega Slime, uh, he, he's told me that he wants to give me, um, animal facts for, uh, for the whole, for the whole group, whole group, uh, of subscribers, whatever, viewers, whatever you guys want to call yourselves, you may. Oh, God. Let's use Rod of Clouds here. Just kind of deal damage to stuff. Hopefully it works out. God, this is just so stupid. Tengu's bad. I'm gonna actually teleport here. Even though we are RF, it's still a pretty freaky fight. Freaky? Scary. I don't know. Same thing. Um, but yeah, so random facts might actually come back at some point, just because like I got nothing else to say for these melee ones. For the mage stuff I can always like talk about random decisions I make, but here it's less so. We use Wand of Clouds again. This Wand of Clouds is actually quite nice, but it's basically just Rod of Clouds. Which means I like it anyway, because I did like Rod of Clouds. God, please, just... just stop. It's so annoying. Oh my god. He's really doing it. Oh god. Just... Oh my god. This is just so embarrassing. I don't even want to be a part of this. Come on, Rakshasa, just die. Thank you, jeez. Alright. Um, dodging can probably come up a bit. We'll try some evocations. My fighting is like by far the strongest or the highest thing in my entire like skill list, but that's completely normal for me, I think. God damn it, it didn't stop. Just all these enemies are just so annoying. Stop. 
Mike, you know what? Fuck off. Go to the abyss. You know what? You want to you play like a kid? Time out. I'll see you back when I'm ready to fight you again. Ooh, shield? Ah, oh, no shield. But this is a better looking shield, so I will pick it up. One of the rare times where I'll actually, like, actually care, care about flavor. And only because Donald's shield looks sick. It looks a lot less sick now, though. Now that it's not 45 degree slant. Used to look really cool. Now it's just, eh. It's still kind of better than the regular shield, but, you know. So we got Icy Blue Scales, AC plus 4, RC plus. That's not that good. Kind of. Um, it's like, eh, decent, I guess. Like, I don't know, RC, AC plus 4 is not incredible, and, I don't know, maybe I'm just being picky, but I know there's definitely better ones. So that's just why I'm like, ah. Oh. Also, we have RC already, with the mace, so we actually have RC double plus. Oh my god, just stop, please. Uh okay, you know what, I'm just going to teleport again. This is just too much. There's too many enemies, like, this is so frustrating. Like, these aren't even, like, tough enemies. It's just, like, so many enemies I don't want to die to. You know, this, like, individually, there's no threat at all. But when they come in, like, a massive group of, like, 10 to 15, I'm just like, uh, I don't even have anywhere to run. This looks like an annoying place. Oh, it's just ogres. Okay, it's fine. Alright, five enchant weapon scrolls. Oh. Is that a vampiric weapon? Oh, it was. Orax. Interesting. Oh, I don't know. Interestingly enough, you're actually not gonna ha you're gonna have a lot more, like, dead air on with this mic, I guess. It seems to be a lot better when it comes to, um, like, not picking up stuff. Oh, shit, this is a lot of stuff. I need to teleport now. Probably shouldn't teleport this much, given that I don't have that much. Whatever. I'll just keep playing like I normally do, expecting a wand of acid, and then we'll see how this works. Oh, my God. Fuck. Hell, mate. Stop. This is just stupid at this point. Like, please stop. This is just embarrassing. I hate this so much. Like, these elves are just being absolute dickheads. They're like weirdly drained. Oh hey Jory, what the hell are you doing here? What? Okay. I guess we'll might you and agility as well. No need to take risks against a character that can crystal speed you and is also very tanky. Uh cloak. Plus one AC, thank you. Alright, that's a demon whip. That's actually very good for us. Yeah, this is getting real fucking like this is getting real old. Like, I'm I'm really getting sick of that. Can you stop please, Waltz? I'm just gonna go ahead and corrupt this place because I'm getting kind of pissed off at this. Yeah, okay. See you later guys. I'm just gonna let the peeps do what they want. Alright, so with this enchanted demon whip, I'm actually going to enchant it to plus 7 and also brand it with distortion. And you might be like, wait, why would you do that? Well, the answer is mostly because for shits and giggles. Uh, and a secondary answer is, you know, because it's not a bad weapon in the first place. Distortion is not terrible. The main reason why people hate it is because it tends to blink people away like that. But if you're in a decent position, it doesn't matter too much most of the time. Abusing corners and such really does help. Um, and if you just abyss stuff, it's like, hey, whatever, free kill. Like, I think distortion is probably like a very uh, underutilized, possibly demonized, like, brand. It's a little bit, ha like, it's overly hated. It's a very strong brand. Yes, it does teleport shit. Yes, it does, like, do other random crap. But that doesn't make it a bad brand, particularly. It's actually quite strong. Alright, this is just... Oh, God. Like, look at the damage. Oh, okay, this sucks. I like how I say it, and then, like, it just sucks straight up after that. That's fine, though. 
Uh, let's get a Might Potion here and hit him with the Vial of Floods. Hit him with the Mace once he's on low health because I don't want him to run away. That was actually kind of bad because um, he has a uh, Holy Wrath, but it's fine. We, we got past it. Also note that the uh, plus 7 became plus 9 because I enchanted it extra uh, with Lagonu's Stinger. Pretty cool. Oh god. Please just hit a him. Whatever, who cares? Male, female, whatever. It's a it's just a shitty elf. Please stop. Oh my god. It's just so sad. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna stand right in this corner and just mess with people. They can blink away, it's fine. Or I can just kill them. It's the same thing really. If you teleport something away and you never see it again, is it dead? Yes. That's the answer. Don't don't even like you don't need to think too much about it. If you never see it again, you you killed it. If you see it again, then it's a new enemy. Don't worry about it. That's how I like to think. It makes me less like annoyed at this distortion. Like, look, this enemy, whatever, I devoured it with my distortion weapon. It's fine. This weapon does a lot of damage. It's not a fast weapon. It's like crazy good. The occasional teleport, it's fine. Whatever. Most of the time I'll catch up to it and kill it. The other times I'll rest and kill it at full health. It's like, no big deal. If I abyss it, free kill, 100%. I think once you like start changing your mindset like that, it becomes a whole lot less frustrating to play. Having said that, though, I would still like. I do know that it's. I'm not saying it's like universally good. There are situations where it's obvious that it sucks, and where you actually need an enemy to stay in place. And it's completely fine to actually swap uh, swap out for that reason. And Lagonu lets you do that nicely. Like for example, here. I don't want to refight this enemy. I'm just gonna kill him with the evening star. I mean, yes, the evening star is less powerful, but whatever, it's fine. I don't know what this is. Detour fighter of El Levelon. You suck. Holy crap. That was like a really bad enemy. The ghost was like just so weak. Oh, it's weird. I mean, it's a deep dwarf of Ellie. It's probably very weak anyway, but like that was surprisingly weak for a deep dwarf. I mean, maybe he just didn't get good luck. Maybe he just went into depths too early. Like, I, like I said, I don't know who these players are most of the time. I don't like almost. Oh shit, I can't even dig out of this. This is so frustrating. Um, like most of the time, uh, I don't even recognize the person's name before I've killed them. Like, I already have dealt with the problem before I register what they are and what they what their name is. So, like at this point, I don't really. I actually don't even know what the name of that ghost was. I just kind of blitzed the room. Sorry, man. Ah, God, isn't this fun? I have to go and uh, pull back all the way here because um, uh, I can only get digging and I don't have digging yet. So that's good RNG. Team with a flaming no. Nah. If it was anti magic or electrocution, I might think about it. It's pretty good. Come on, man. Get him. Alright, cool. Evocation at 6, that's not bad. I think armor can stay at like 15, 17. It doesn't need to be that high. High armor. It could be higher, but whatever. Okay, I'm just kind of hitting the boggets as I walk back. Uh, because it'll slowly deal with the enemies. It's kind of how you like do a melee anti boggot strategy. You kind of just walk backwards and then as they blink towards you, because they're stupid. Uh, you just kind of hit him in the face once or twice. And if you're melee, you're usually killing him in one hit. So it's pretty good. Alright, hasted mighty trolls. That's not good. Uh, god. Okay, I can actually abyss that one. I'm probably wasting too many resources on this. I should just take it out with an actual weapon, but... I don't know. Something about me just... Wants to wait till the yeah unhaste and un berserks and then kill him. Ooh, spark wasp. Are we RLX? Yes, we are. How do we get RLX? Nice. Ah, the plate armor. Yes. How could I have forgotten? Boy, I really wish I could do anything to change the terrain here because this is really annoying. I guess I'll just have to go and bring him all the way back to the upstairs. Wow. This is pretty good gameplay. 
Like, you're not going to fight a, a pack that big. It just doesn't make sense. Nonsensical for that purpose. Just doesn't make a lot. So, like, the the best strategy is to pull them upstairs. And in depth, you don't tend to get corridors that much. So, if you remove digging, that'd be fun. Because now the entire dungeon is RNG and not just the regular equipment. You actually have to pray for good RNG on your dungeon. That's really stupid. So, I hope that happens. Will finally be released. Never to play again. Anyway, moving on. I don't know. Things do get depressing when I'm just sitting here for like 40 minutes straight by myself doing nothing. I don't know. Sometimes it happens. I mean, like I said, I recorded my second video today. This is like, I do tend to go a bit lazy. Also, it's really hot, like legit 40, 40 degrees outside. It's pretty insane. And for those of you Americans, 40 degrees Celsius, not not a uh, not Fahrenheit. So it's like 105 or 110 outside. Like it's pretty hot, just a bit. Like it's gotten so bad that like if I have my aircon on for like more than half an hour, it just like burns to be inside my room. I just don't want to be in here. Like it's not even like like a full hour. It literally heats up in half an hour. It's crazy. Like to outside temperature. It's just the most painful thing ever. Though I guess it's because I'm sitting here and I'm a hot hot person, you know what I mean? Naturally hot. I think uh I feel like these things don't without that shit eating grin, like the, the jokes just don't come across as well. <laughs> but that's alright. Like I made a shit eating grin. That's how you were supposed to know it was a joke. It was self-deprecating humor, but because you don't know, you didn't see it. Just it looked like an asshole. But that's fine. Like that's this is also an acceptable result. God, is this the lich one? Fuck this one. Nope. 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 No. Get the fuck back in your cubby house. Close the doors. X them all out. See you later. I'm not dealing with that. There's a lot more ancient liches and other things I don't want to deal with. Hmm, evasion's probably good here. Ah, oh, no. Nah. Magic protection is pretty decent as well. Probably worthwhile for me to keep it on. Maybe not. Let's turn armor off for a bit, and we'll keep everything else on. I guess evocations can come off at about 12. I mean, it's not really that great. I have to keep pumping it for attack ones, L-U-L. Like, that's just... that's a bit embarrassing. Alright, I think at some point we stop using the distortion weapon, and I think it doesn't matter. So whatever. Like if I had an evening star, I'd be using that instead of the. Uh, like I said, the distortion's kind of for memes. It's not really like incredibly good, even if it is plus nine. I'm mostly doing it because I already know I can win with this weapon alone. I don't need another weapon. Plus three crush is pretty good. I mean, it, yes, it could be plus six crush or plus t uh, plus nine crush, but eh, this is as good as like this is as bad as I'm willing to accept. So, well, actually, no, I've I've won with worse. Like far worse, so you know, winning with just a plus three crush is not a big deal. I mean, an evening star is just a good weapon, right? It's not like it's terrible in the first place. The base weapon is one of the best one-handers in the game. Like literally the best. Uh, what else is pretty good? I mean, like double swords, pretty good. Evening star, demon whip, demon weapons in general. Like that's about it, really. Like, and maybe a broad axe if you're feeling. Wait, this isn't a. That's not death's five. What the hell? What's this big castle doing here? I'm offended. I don't want to deal with that. Nah, let's just nah, exit out. Nah, I don't want to deal with that. Too lazy. So as you can see, I'm a master of just skipping content. Oh look, it's a hard looking vault. Just skip it. That's fine. <laughs> this is, that's the that's the best part about depths currently. Like the only like saving grace that you don't have to do all of it. If I had to do every single bit of depths, like I think a couple of them were like suggesting nah the game's over man it's it's dead because there's no way that's not feasible okay we got drained to hell shit so that's good let's try to kill these guys i hope he's not draining me you son of a bitch you're draining me oh god holy shit we are drained to all shit whoa 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 holy fuck are you kidding me dude I've never been this badly drained before. 
uh, let's might to kill this guy, I guess. I mean, this is like, this is actually, re okay, we need to go into elf. Hmm, that's not a good idea. Okay, we are interestingly drained. Like, I couldn't really get out of that without teleporting. I didn't want to teleport that early because... Okay, well, this is interesting. I've actually got zero skills in all my stuff. That is fun. Okay, I think that makes the whip of distortion better, if that's the case. Because I can just kind of cheese kills. Okay, this is a very interesting exercise. What do you do when you have literally zero skills? Whoa. That's actually like a completely novel scenario for me. I've never been in this situation before. That's awesome. I mean, it would be if like, I wasn't dying. You know. Is this death? Like, am I legit dead? I actually need to pop some stuff. Like, this is not good. Okay. I just need to like kill a couple of these and I'll get back to normal. Or at least like serviceable levels. This is just unacceptable completely. Jesus Christ. Double draining Spriggans is just not fun. Alright, we've got almost four skill in Mason Flails. That basically makes us god tier, right? Alright, great. Okay, wow. Alright, let's just use this weapon now. I think this is enough. It's enough fucking around. Just get him out. God, look at that. We're taking so hard. It's so hard to, like, kill these things. That thing drained me again. God damn it. I think, I don't think it hit the... Okay. If we can pull over here, we can actually get a lot of kills here. Uh, so draining works, like, kind of exponentially, kind of, sort of. So, like, the more drained I am, the more EXP I'll recover every kill. So, I just need to kill, like, maybe 20 enemies and I'll be, like, in acceptable shape. Oh, never mind. I got drained again. I'm actually going to die here because I've drained so heavily. Uh, what have we missed? Slime, Vaults, Elf, Depths, Orc. Yeah, I've literally got nothing left. I have to do Elf or I have to do Depths, and I'm not doing Depths. That's way too hard. Okay, this looks good. This is very promising. Unless that can drain me as well, then I'm just screwed. Okay, no, it doesn't look like it. Awesome. Okay, I'm like ridiculously drained right now. Oh my god, I got drained again. Holy shit, okay. Oh my god, this is actually like the worst situation. I'm not dead, but I'm basically dead and I wish I was dead. Um, There is literally no way I can think of that would help this character get out other than just man up and just do it. Like this is... holy shit, this is actually insane. Um, hmm. I guess I just have to abuse my, like, positional advantage, kind of. Which I don't even have, because these guys are just so goddamn strong. I mean, the only thing, we're, like, we're literally a level zero character with, uh, with, like, an extraordinary amount of health. That's literally what we are right now. This is, whoa, this is messed up. And, like, the problem is, elf is, like, not a great place to go to heal because I'm getting more drained by these enemies every day. Jesus Christ, this is insane. Ah, uh, crypt, crypt, yes. Crypt sounds like a very unintuitive answer because crypt you would be like, oh there's a lot of drain. It's actually not as much as I think there is. I'm pretty sure there's a little bit that I like of the XP that I can kind of steal. So I'm gonna try to do that. This is gonna be a tough fight though. Whoa, this character is Dead in the water. Okay. Okay, I need to actually like abuse things because this is getting out of hand. Okay. Just abusing the mutation at this point. Ah, oh, crap. He's healing. Okay, we need to leave. <laughs> okay, we need to leave. Heal up fully. Alright, cool. We can pull one up. That's good. Just take out one. Then take out the other one. Okay. 4.5 Mason Flails, that's pretty good. <laughs> 4.5 Mason Flails in Vault 3. <laughs> After Depths 2, holy shit, this is insane. <laughs> okay, okay. So the reason why I picked Crip is because a lot of these enemies can't actually drain me. Like, a lot of them do other things. 
Still nasty, yes, but not as drainy as you would expect from a place called Crypt. I mean, like, this is MR minus, or MR halved. Like, these are just plain undead. This is a summoner. Like, there's not, it's not as drainy as you would hope, which is good. Oh my god. And hopefully we can just prey on this really shitty undead, and we'll get, like, some EXP off them, because this is just, ooh, spicy. Ooh, that can drain me. Jangshi's don't drain, I think. It, it like leeches my life life essence, but it doesn't actually drain me. It like steals my life, basically. This is also another enemy that can't drain me. All right, we're starting to reach like pretty good damage now, which is good. We're gonna stay here until our drain is completely gone, though. I think it's just a little bit safer. Oh my god. Okay, we need to go on different stairs. Need to make sure that I'm not fighting too. Fuck, he can drain me too. Uh, we didn't lose too much drain. It's not bad. Ow. Okay, it's champion. It's fine. The flay is really hurting, but it's okay. Okay, that's okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dude, 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 whoa, whoa. Chillax, bro. It's just a prank. Okay, let's hit him with a vial of floods. Okay, I'm actually gonna also pick up this box of beasts because this is kind of scary. Our evocations is like kind of reasonable at this stage, so it's decent for us to kind of get that. Oh my god, this thing can drain me too. Shit. Yeah, so like some enemies can drain me and those are the ones I need to be afraid of because they're the ones that are screwing me over. Okay, we got drained further. Damn it. Damn it, stop draining me, you scumbag. Oh my god, we got drained again. Like, oh, fuck, man. This is this is literally impossible. Like, what is this right now? We're so heavily. J fuck. Oh my god. Okay. We're back to zero again. Fuck. Please stop draining me, for the love of God. Okay, let's just mite him. Fuck this guy. Come over here, dickhead. We'll take you on too. Oh my god. No, no, fuck. Why is it that... Yeah, look, so the reason why we leave these places alone is because they drain us, but I don't have a choice. I have to stay here, pretty much. But now we're, like, back down to Shitsville again, which is really sad, but... God. It's like, what else can you do? Honestly. At some point, you just have to, like, get shit done, you know? I mean, we could technically just scum this place. Um, for like a scrap just to get us enough EXP to like actually be okay in melee but like this is just something else <sighs> okay try to kill these undead because they won't mess with us make sure to heal at full health okay mace is at four that's pretty incredible go down the third staircase Okay, yeah, crypt is un undoable. Un uncompletable. Holy shit. Um I actually have no answer for this at all. Like I've literally got no answer. I think that the answer is just scum vaults because this is fucked and I am fucked. <laughs> okay, well this is This is an answer. But it's not a great answer. It's a very slow and inefficient way of doing things, but we have no choice, I think, at this point. Unless I want to chance a TP down bot uh, to. Oh, not a TP, sorry. Uh, like a corruption or something. But we can't even corrupt because we have no freaking pie, uh, no invocations. Oh my god. We just have to, like, find it. Oh, okay. No, not these enemies. Okay, we're at a teleport too, so we're basically lost. Okay, let's just go into depths. Okay, fine. We'll just try to fight like really hardcore enemies and just risk it for the biscuit. Actually, wait, what's was that? Unseen? Ooh. Maybe there's enemies here. Nope. Okay, yeah, this might actually be the place we can do things. I mean, I could go back to Lair and Scum, but that doesn't seem right. So these giants might actually be the key to winning. 
I'll just have to farm them up. Like, I really didn't want to go in here because it's like a lot of enemies and it's a long time, but, you know, it might have to happen. We're actually out of teleport too, so this is pretty scary, to be honest. Alright, if we do see the Spriggan Defender again, we're going to hasten might, I think, at the very least. Like, this is just, that's ridiculous. Alright, we got one evocations. Fuck, is this, this is anti-magic, okay, that's good. That's regular draining, and that is... Okay, let's might and haste here, so we have an answer. Okay, they're all on my ass. Okay, the Spriggan Defender is the one that screwed me over there. Oh my god. No, that was a mistake. No, no, no. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, fuck. Not you. Why you? Anyone but you would have been fucking fine. God damn it, man. Okay, fuck this guy. He can just die. Oh my god. For fuck's sake, man. We just got out of that. Alright, well at least we know that now there's no drain on this floor. Or there shouldn't be any more. Is, oh, for God's sake, man. For, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh. Okay, that was a good shot. Actually, I'm going to switch over to the distortion weapon, just because it might do some more damage. I think that's actually better. It seems to be doing a lot more DPS. Oh, that's actually not bad. Okay, there's a lot of guys we don't want to fight yet. Okay, nice. Thank you for the free kill. Thank you for another free kill. Just gonna pull them up one by one. Fight them over here. Fight them over there. You know, just do a bit of fighting everywhere. Alright. We've almost got three evocations now. That's pretty impressive. Definitely can't fight that uh, vampire knight by, by myself. I have to... Sorry. In a not 1v1. He's just healing straight up off me. I I literally can't even fight this guy. Like he is going to kill me, and it's gonna be so sad. Okay, blink. Oh my god! Please stop! Please stop! Please stop! Okay, that's a bit better. Nice. Alright, that's free XP there. It's literally free XP. Oh, there's a lot of enemies here too. Maybe I can take these out. Even before it's like a Shadow Dragon, I'm just like, fuck, I give up. It might be actually. This does look like a Shadow Dragon looking area. Okay. What are you doing right now to me? Scumbag. Alright, cool. Plus two shield protection. That's a good pickup. Makes us a little bit more tanky. Okay, plus six ring of evasion, that's pretty amazing. And a teleport scroll, that's good. This is less good. Um, shit. Okay, Agi here. Just to try to like, make sure I don't die to these guys. Okay, the drain is now at red. We have actually made it kind of back in the clear. Holy shit, that was... Oh, that was, that was something else, man. Well, this is still something else. Technically, it's not done yet. Okay, we actually need to clear this whole floor. Oh my god. This video is, like, so long. I'm so sorry. <laughs> what the fuck? This is actually messed up. Like, I hate it. Alright, we're only at Crimson Drain now. That's... That's so easy. <laughs> like, we're so strong now. <laughs> oh my god. It's just unbelievable power crazy. Like, look at this. We can actually fight things. We don't die in one hit. That's actually stupid. I think this game is too easy. Honestly. Oh, god. That's a lot of stuff. Please stop. Don't drain me. Okay, pull all the live stuff. Using the undead there is a bit of a shield. This is actually, like, a really funny video. Oh my god, we're yellow drained. I've never even seen this color. What is that? Wait, you're telling me we can actually kill stuff now? Whoa, what? No, you must be joking. We went from like so weak to like so strong in like less than a floor. That was. 
Oh my god, we actually got the drain out. <laughs> oh my god. That was so retarded. Oh, that was actually the most sad thing I've ever seen in my life. Zero <laughs> skill in depth. Holy shit. That was really funny. Uh, anyway. We have to head out soon. This is a recharging scroll. I'm gonna probably pop some of these on the ones of absolute nothing, but that's fine. Okay, I'm gonna leave this for later because holy shit, that's actually cool. Um, but that was an interesting scenario. That's my first time ever being drained to zero. Well, kind of. The fighting wasn't zero, but everything else was. That was pretty insane. So that was whoa. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you all tomorrow.